Hello and welcome. Today we are going to do some Tales of the Borderlands. Yeah. And we'll see what happens. Let's do it! Back again to hear another story of immense fortune and unthinkable peril. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora were told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. Mm -hmm. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, <laughs> somewhat unsporting. He ran the corporation Hyperion and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack. But forget the adventurers who risk it all for less, uh, obvious rewards. Yes. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Will we? I wonder. That's a big head. And teeth. Fiona! Come on, we can work this out! Yeah, probably not a good idea. Yona? <laughs> what, is there some sort of radiation leak I don't know about? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Told you. Ah. Fudge, that's us. Oh dear. Duct tape. What is happening right now? I ask the questions. Okay, then do you mind asking yourself what you're doing? Oh! <laughs> oh what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas Project. <laughs> is that what this is about? <laughs> Look. Gordas is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, 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 okay. Don't be a smartass. <laughs> I'm not a patient person. That's a good way to do so it. Just start talking. Just where do you start when you're getting dragged through the desert and uh From the beginning. Right. Do we have to? It might be a long story. And nobody wants to listen to a long story. Unless it's interesting. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. Yep. And Handsome Jack? He's a dick. He was the you baddest guy of them all. This long. It must feel good I to find a rabbit, just you know? like him. No, you don't. Take it. It's yours, right? <laughs> I mean, you always said that. <laughs> Everyone did. I gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but uh but hey, here Which we are. Which resulted in a company 
overflowing with assholes. Animals. When Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. But a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives. Yes, for the best. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're going to buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. If you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be rolling in it. Yeah, I figure I could get lunch. Seems like a good place yep. to start. Well, then we're starting with three of whatever's most expensive. Sure. And wine pairings. For lunch? We're gonna get twisted, bro. If I'm not puking up $500 in food and alcohol this afternoon, then we are doing it wrong. We're meeting with a vet afterwards to celebrate. Idea. She booked us a table. Yep. Sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because you made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. You're damn right I deserve it. I earned this. Well, Yvette and I did contribute. <laughs> oh. Time to be sure, a dick. You, you help some. All right, man. Let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right, yeah. Hmm. Oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. There is no seat. No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Yeah, but I don't want it in red. I want it in black. Because black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why, okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. <laughs> Company car. Didn't even have to ask. You look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. So you might not have been in the loop, but it's for the better. At least for me. Uh, <laughs> Henderson promised me a promotion. I see. Well, Henderson is out, so... You're going to be reporting to me now, Reese. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> Cause I... But this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? For the exact same reason why North is North. Why the handsome guy always gets the girl and why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a dick. Because you're a dick. It's destiny, race. And men, real men, men like me, make their own. And you could hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul, your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fame. Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. You don't want to be that man. Wow. I could not have timed that better. That really oh helps dear. dramatically. So that's what mind. happened. Which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny and put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digistructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh... Are you buying this vault key or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Of course I'm still interested. I... Yes, I'm near a computer. 
Ten million. Yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short million. notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. Uh-huh. Yeah, 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 no, but... Do you want the money or not? Because I... Ha. Huh. It's not. No, it won't be a big deal for me to get... Okay. Yes. Why are you trying to screw me on this? Oh, fine. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down it. If it's gonna be ten million dollars, I'm gonna need another hour or two. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well, then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure. Sure. I want a spice sure. mug. Okay. Say hi to your mom. Damn it. Ah, uh, right. And uh, what were we talking about? Your dick, your dick. Before we were so rudely interrupted. We were talking... <clears throat> we were talking about my promotion. Oh, you should have done... All right, your uh, promotion. Anderson was a fool. He didn't know his place. He now needed he lesson number one. Humility. But you, I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm gonna make you assistant vice janitor. What? N no, no, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Oh dear. Effective immediately. Fine. I've had to do worse in my career. <laughs> That's the spirit, Reese. Let's go on to Nothing teaches you humility faster than scrubbing twins. You're dismissed, the Reese. Hell out of him. And leave his office untidy. I'll let you know when I need my trash can empty. What the hell was that? He can't do this to us! He just did. No. No, no, this can't be happening. I'm finished, Bob. I'm finished. You know who this place is. There's blood in the water! And everyone can smell it! No, 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 they can't. Not yet, unless you don't quiet down. Take it. Senior Vice Janitor Reese to Sector D451 for trash cleanup. Because that is your job now, to clean up trash with your bare hands. Sorry, you were saying something, I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash Let's duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Huh. Vasquez screwed me out of the promotion. He threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap. So, does that mean you're not buying? Well, just try and lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type we to... We can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just Let's killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. We're gonna ruin his career. How do you plan on doing that? Yeah. Vasquez set up a deal on Pandora for a vault key. Whoa. A vault key? Uh-huh. And I'm sure he promised a die period. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is its vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Asquez, we have a friggin' vault key! I mean, what are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. 
Hold, please. Done. I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting. I mean, it's, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed, Whoa, whoa, right? whoa, hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. You know, things get dicey. Look, it's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing yep. from and Hyperion. And fun. But we're friends. Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Richter was an asshole, and his family are assholes. Please, Yvette. You want me to get stuck in the awful existence of being a janitor? Vasquez really screwed us, didn't yes. he? And let's screw him back. Fine. But I'm still hungry. No problem. We only got a couple of hours. <sighs> Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clearance to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? I mean, you can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just... If you're gonna steal something, I uh, figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got oh, a car dear. in mind. I wonder whose car that is. It's not a good green glow. how trashed we can make that car. Person. Would you cross right there? Oh, crap. I think we... I think we killed it. Are we murderers now? We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great, we murder. Relax, Vaughn. It's a skag. They breed like hostile rabbits down here. Still, it's kind of sad. Yeah. Kind of. I'm still alive. That's good. Anyway. So, what do we say if someone asks where we got the money? What do you mean? Well, I mean, what do we tell people? We should have a story. I, mean, I would prefer not to tell them that we stole it from Hyperion. That would not go over well. We can just say it's for charity. What does that even mean? We say it's uh, some sort of open a vault for Pandorans kind of deal. People love stuff when it's attached to a charity. They hardly ever question their intentions. So, this looks not good. 
got ourselves a new <laughs> here! What are you looking at? It's Pandora. What did you expect? Yeah, no, I know. Uh, I, I guess I'm just now more acutely aware that I have ten million dollars chained to me is all. In a neighborhood, I might add, of back planet nut jobs. Fine, don't be such a wuss. You know, when you say things like that, I sometimes forget you're pretending to be the guy who would say things like that. Yes, it, wait, what? Okay, look. It's a boring, dusty old town. Nothing more, all right? Sure. Listen, one tap on the arm, and Yvette can send down a loader bot if things get too entertaining. That's true. And she gave me this. It is a stun baton. I do not know how it works, but it's definitely neat. Yeah, stick. Neato. God, I can't wait to be in that chair. You, me, Yvette. I mean, we bring this key back, and they're gonna make us the once and future kings of that place for sure. They'll send in a crew to use the key, and then that's it? Yeah, yeah, we'll pop champagne and everything after we get back with the key. Ah, come on, it's in the bag! The tracker's beep beep beeping, but I don't see the place. It's the world of curiosities, right? Yeah, do you see it? No. Could ask one of them. They seem... normal-ish? Normal-ish enough? Anyway? What an excellent idea. I thought so myself. This is not a good idea, I don't think, anyway. Do you know where the world of curiosities is? Everywhere. Uh... It should be around here. You lost? Um... What are you here for? It's just a simple business deal. A few papers to sign, and then we're out. Easy. Huh. Those the papers? Of a sort? You're Hyperion. You wake suckers ruined this town, you know that? Atlas were bastards, but at least they had the good sense to fail. Listen, all we want are directions to the world of curiosities. That's it, okay? We get that, and we're gone. Gone, huh? Hey, little man. What's in the Your case? Mom. Hey, kitty cat. Show us what's in the no. case. Oh dear. Okay, now, look, before we get all bent... <laughs> oh. Is there, like, a convention yep. or something? Oh. <laughs> Bandits. You know what we got here? Reese, do the... We got a couple Hyperion warmongers, gentlemen. The bot! Yvette, prime it! Already? Really? Just <laughs> give, give me the menu. Okay, but don't go bananas. These things ain't cheap. And do you know what we do with warmongers? Do you know what we do? Should we tell them what we do with Hyperion go. workers? Motorbot deployed. Time to clock in. Listen, boys. You're gonna hand over that case, or you're handing over your heads. Your choice. Look, guys, let's talk about this. That's gonna do it. Ooh. That's gonna Got be quiet all of a sudden. <laughs> Anything. Angry eyes detected. Go 
awaiting instruction. It only does what I tell it to. Well, tell it to do something already. Please stop shooting me. Engaging target. See? Piece of cake. He must really have to go. That is not good. Come on! Okay, maybe I didn't, you know, technically die, but I could have.